how to schedule quantity and cost of floor tile 0.6 by 0.6 in Revit create shared type parameter shared parameter create new type tile cost <coughs> land currency uh, type of uh, okay okay go to pro project parameters add shared parameters select select tile cost okay select type group under identity data then select the floors <coughs> okay okay create global parameter to assign in our tile cost parameter go to global parameters create new type tile 0.6 by 0.6 cost type of parameter mm, currency group under identity data okay the for the cost let's put uh, 200 apply okay assign tile cost from global parameter into floor select the floor edit type check tile cost select and select the tile 0.6 by 0.6 cost okay 200 apply okay create schedule quantities for floor under schedule tab view schedule schedule quantities then new construction select floors <coughs> okay then insert type the area okay then the tile cost okay then add calculated parameter and name it tile quantity in piece okay okay type tile quantity then for the formula select area okay uh, over point 36 open and close parentheses then times 1.10 okay note point 36 is the area of 0.6 by 0.6 floor tile 1.10 is the plus 10% allowance for breakage. 9. Add calculated parameter and name it total cost. <coughs> then for the type select currency formula select tile quantity times the tile cost okay okay then sorting and grouping check grand totals formatting total cost alignment right check field format okay 
calculate totals then tile cost alignment right check field format okay tile quantity alignment right field format and check go to fix two decimal places use digit grouping okay then calculate totals area alignment right field format uncheck two decimal places use digit grouping okay then calculate totals uh, appearance uncheck blank row before data okay okay let's look at the schedule okay now have the type 60 by 60 floor tile we have the area the tile quantity per piece okay 305 pieces tile cost and the total cost now let's try to change the cost under global parameter let's say 250 apply okay now you have the revised cost of 